Greetings, 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 my V family all over the world. This is your chief and this is week number seven. And if you are getting the Wednesday message a bit late from the V, it's not Irish's fault from V Studios, it's mine. I had a crazy day. I lost track of time. I lost track of the day. I don't even know what day it is. All right. So I came to Bangkok. I was with Atli, Donna, Dave Watwani, Kavita. All right. Speaking to an amazing group of people until like 1 a.m. last night. I reached at 2 a.m. Then I was on calls hammering some some future max out kings and queens. All right. Having a, um, beautiful mentoring sessions. And then I said, okay, 5 in the morning, 5.30 in the morning. Let's lie down, relax. And I woke up and suddenly realized, oh my God. I have not recorded the Wednesday message, all right? So here I am, your chief, dedicated to you. Then I jumped out of bed, jumped into the shower. Irish is panicking in Manila. Everyone is panicking. So it'll be a bit delayed, but it's worth the wait, all right? So I'm in Bangkok, the most beautiful city in the world, all right? I'm head, rushing back to Malaysia in a few days to spend a few days with Dato Sri Vijay Ishwaran, all right? The great one. And uh, yesterday I was talking to a group of networkers, then I was talking to a group of people who uh, came into this uh, 5,000 BV club. And I want to share this message. I think I shared it long time ago, but I want to share it with you again. All right. Uh, and even if you're new, you've been around for a long time, you're building the business. I want you to listen carefully to your chief, your upline, representing the great ones, Japa and Dato Sri Vijay. Um, I've been building this business for 25 years. I've seen it all. I've heard it all. And yesterday, while talking to all these people, I realized what was missing in most people. It came back as a memory. That one of the biggest mistakes people fail to understand is that QNET is a business. It is a serious, multi-million dollar business. So just look at the potential. You buy a product or multiple products, whether you buy... Um, 1,000 BV, 3,000 BV, 5,000 BV, you have access to one or multiple tracking centers. And each of these tracking centers has a maximum income you could earn from one TC. And currently at Blue Diamond, you could earn up to 25,000 US dollars a week from your one TC, which comes to 100,000 US a month, which comes to 1.2 million US a year income that very few people on the planet achieve, income, profit that very few people in business achieve. All right. And I want you to put that in your mind. That's what you are aiming for as your first mega goal. Your goal is to become a, a US dollar millionaire, bottom line. Okay. That's the goal. And is it possible? 100%. Have I seen it with these two eyes? Yes. If I experience it, experience it myself, yes. All right. So even with a moron, with a dream can achieve it. Anyone can achieve it, guys. But I want you to understand this. The problem is you're sitting there today. You haven't made that decision. Now, the first decision that you have to choose to make to really embark on a serious journey with QNET is, are you the one? Are you the one? who is going to break the chain of poverty in your family. Now, what is the chain of poverty? You know the theory. There's nobody who was suddenly appeared on the planet rich. Everyone was originally poor. Are you guys with me? Uh, my father was poor, good man, worked in the government service, nothing wrong with it, but he was not rich. My grandfather was not rich. My great-grandfather was not rich. The same applies to you. I am not disrespecting them. I think they all didn't have opportunity. They did what they could to do, what they could do. But if you look at the rest of the people, you look at Bill Gates, Steve Jobs, Mukesh Ambani, Sheikh Zaid, 
all right, if you look at all these people, all right, they were the ones who broke the chain of poverty in their family by starting a business, taking it seriously, paying the price and building that business. Now, I am the one in my family that broke the chain of poverty. That means my children were born millionaires. All right. I hope they don't take it for granted. All right. And I broke the chain of poverty. That means after me, unless they screw up very badly, we will have generations of people with good financial wealth. Are you guys with me? And that's why I tell people that you are not doing this only for yourself. You're doing this for many generations to come. So the first question you should answer is, are you the one who's going to break the chain of poverty of your family? Now, if you don't, you are a moron because this opportunity QNET has come and fallen in your, in your hands. And all you have to do now is make it happen. All right? And you can change the course of history in your family. And I want you to understand this. It's happened to me. It has happened to so many people. All the people, all the max out kings, max out queens, V partners, blue diamonds, diamonds, platinums that we have in our organizations, today, the thousands of them are the ones who broke the chain of poverty in their family. It's unbelievable. Are you guys with me? And if you ask them, how did they do it? the first thing they will answer is that they took this business seriously, that they respected QNET as a serious business opportunity, that it was not a hobby, it was not try, let's see what happens. They took it as a serious business opportunity. Now, you don't think that way. And that what must change on week number seven, because in your moronic mindset, I know exactly how you think because I was thinking that way 25 years ago. That we think business, traditional business, means you take a loan from a bank, millions of dollars, open up a shop, sit down there, sing Kumbaya every day and pray that your business succeeds. All right? And now in QNET, you, you buy products for $700, $5,000, $3,000 and that's nothing. That's not serious money at all, any part of the world. And that does not create the click that this is a serious business. You think you just bought some products, you have a tracking center, inshallah, let's see what happens. That's the biggest mistake people make. That's the number one reason why people do not reach the end game of financial freedom. Not because they don't know how to know the business, not because they don't have good uplines, not because blah, 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 blah. It's because they don't respect QNET as a serious business opportunity. They don't respect QNET as a 1.2 million US potential income business. They look at it as this, okay, let's see what happens. Let me try. I hope it works. I'll do my best, but I'm busy. My cat has a birthday, blah, 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 blah. That's the biggest mistake people make. The number one mistake, all right? It's moronic if you don't respect QNET as a serious business because I have seen with my own eyes all right, people from zero to 1.2 million US a year. That will break the chain of poverty. Just because you don't have to take a loan, all right, to open a traditional shop doesn't mean that QNET is not a serious business. All right. And I want to tell you the story I always tell in all my videos. Let's say you took a loan of half a million dollars. You open a restaurant. How many days would you open the restaurant? Seven days a week. What time would you start? Six in the bloody morning. What time would you close? If possible, two in the morning. Now, let's say there is one day, all right? You're dead tired. You've been serving people the whole day and you are finished and you're closing your restaurant down and suddenly you see 50 people walking towards your restaurant. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? You're going to open that door immediately and say, come in, come in, come in. All right. And the guy is going to ask you, were you not closing your restaurant, sir? No, I was testing the door. Please come in. Because that's the pressure of the half a million dollar loan you took from the bank. That if you don't pay, they're going to take your house, take your car, take everything and destroy your life. All right. 
But here in QNET, you don't have that, that pressure. And that's why people don't succeed. People don't succeed because there's no pressure. There's no risk. You understand? All right? Because if you were running a restaurant, you would never close it on your mother-in-law's birthday. You would leave it open on Diwali, Christmas, Eid, Chinese New Year. All right? You understand? You would never close it for your own birthday, for your son's birthday. You would not close it on a public holiday. You would leave your restaurant open every single day of the year to maximize your income, to pay back the 500000 to the bank and start earning profit so you can be the one who becomes the one who breaks the chain of poverty in your family. But this QNET business you're doing, you have Sunday off, all right? Your son's birthday, you take two days off. Diwali, you take one day off. You have a bad day, you switch off. Negative article, you want to give up. All right? Your upline says the answer to success is presentation, presentation, presentation. You don't do consistent presentation. You're not doing rule three. All right? Your name list hasn't been updated for one year. Your dream list hasn't been upgraded for five years. That's the mistake you're making. You're not taking your journey with QNET seriously. So the people to succeed are not smarter than you. They're not better networkers than you. The term better networker, best networker does not exist. Me, Japa, Dato Sri Vijay, we are not the greatest networkers in the world. All right? We just switched on 24 hours a day. We never switched off. Japa and Dato Sri Vijay has not switched off since September 8, 1998. Are you with me? That's the key to success. That's why we are the fastest growing network marketing company in the world. Your challenge is you don't treat it like a serious business. Because if you treat it like a serious business, you will never switch off. You will never, you know, get distracted. Are you guys with me? That just because this is not a traditional kind of business, but it's not a hobby. I have seen nobodies earn 1.2 million US a year. I've seen people who couldn't afford to pay bus fare today flying first class. So all I'm asking you to do is to take this business seriously. That whether you bought 1,000, 3,000, 5,000, 7,000 BV, it doesn't matter. I know the money is not big, but you got to think big. You got to understand that the potential income for QNET that you could earn as an IR surpasses any income of any traditional business that will require you to sell your house or take a loan. Can you imagine how powerful this is? So don't waste this opportunity. You are an entrepreneur. All right? You are the one who's going to break the chain of poverty in your family. Wake up, smell the coffee. This business works. I've seen it work for 25 years. We have created thousands of US dollar millionaires all over the world. Now it's your time to decide. Respect QNET. Respect it as a serious business. You are the CEO of your tracking center. You are 100% shareholder of your tracking center, which has the potential to give you profits and earnings of 1.2 million US a year. And all you have to do is talk to people, talk to people, talk to people. Never, ever, ever, ever switch off. Stop listening to the world and one day the world will listen to you. Watch the Wednesday message. Watch Instagram. Come to VCon. Listen to Dato Sri Vijay's videos. All right? Follow the system of your upline. Do whatever it takes, guys. But this business will be your opportunity to break the chain of poverty in your family. So don't waste this opportunity. This is the master plan knocking you in your head and saying, hey, I'm giving you this chance to rise again. I'm giving you this chance to change the future of your children and grandchildren. Don't waste it. Don't be lazy. All right? And it's knocking you on the head. Don't ignore the master plan. This year, 2024, you are an entrepreneur. You are the CEO. You are the businessman, you are the businesswoman with a potential, initial potential of earning 1.2 million US a year. Don't waste it. All right? This year, become unstoppable. Are you guys with me? I love you guys. 
and I had Sawadee Cup from Bangkok.